Hey guys, today I'm going to share with you a quick tutorial on the new Procreate 4.2 feature called Gallery Preview. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you a unique way to use this with your logo client. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make four different logos and they are going to be acting as logo options for my client as if I'm meeting this client in person and showing them four different options that they can choose from for their project. So this is just a mock mono line logo that I made, clearly. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a second one with my brush pen. Like that. Center it a little bit. One's good to go. That's logo option number two. And then let's do another logo option with my other more standard brush pen. Okay, so that's logo option three. Center that a little bit more. And then let's do one more option with a little bit of a smaller mono line brush. Okay, there we go. Good to go. Okay, so now I have four logo choices right here. And what I can do is maybe color each one of them a different color like maybe this one background is going to be purple just honestly for keeping in cohesion with branding it really doesn't matter what you want to do but this is if you're showing a client some options in person and you just want to add a little personal touch to whatever you're doing And this right here, if you're wondering, this is my own um, brand color palette that I made and I'll make a video um, sooner rather than later of how to do that for your own brand color palette. Okay, so these four are looking good. So what we're going to do is come up here and click select. Then we are going to select these. One, two, three, four. And then we're going to click preview. And so right here, this is the gallery preview and it looks beautiful. And again, you can do this in so many different ways. You can maybe put a number in the top corner with um, option one, some text like that, or maybe some designer's note, something like that, whatever you wanna do. But for the sake of this, I'm just doing it simplistically. Okay, so this would be option number one for the client. Here's option number two for the client. Here's option number three for the client. And here's option number four for the client. And it's really cool because you can just toggle back and forth and show them, you know, what the differences between each option are and which one would fit them best. And so it's a really cool way to showcase your work um, right within Procreate. And then you just exit out, exit out again, and that's it. And you're good to go. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and I will see you next week.